What's up guys, this is Jimmy here and today I have something super, super insane to share with you guys. So in this video, we're going to be talking about this brand new any car for free glitch. It's made its way into the community and a lot of people are using this glitch to get any car for free in GTA Online and I want to talk about it. I want to share a few things with you and inform you on a few things that you guys definitely need to know. But before we get started and get ready in this video, can we go for 10,000 likes? Times three, 30,000 likes, dude. Let's do it. I know we can do it. I know we have the potential. The GTA community is so strong, so I know we can do it. And I also want to point out if you guys are new to my channel and you guys usually don't watch my content, I recommend you guys do hit that subscribe button below so you never miss another informational video like this here on my YouTube channel. I upload daily videos so I wouldn't want you guys to miss out on any recent news that you guys miss out on or just anything in general. So recently there has been this new glitch that has hit online consoles and a lot of people are using this glitch right now to get any car for free. They're also using this to sell the vehicles to get unlimited money and a lot of people are using this to their advantage. Now I want to point out that I'm pretty you know neutral with exploits and doing good in GTA because either or I don't I don't even do both of them you know I don't even make money legitimate I also don't even make money by exploiting I buy shark cards so right now me I'm in the shark card ranch okay I'm in that one separate ranch but there's a lot of people that exploit in online and there's also a lot of people that like to play legitimately. So there seems to be this new glitch going around where you could get any car for free and then you can just literally use those vehicles to your advantage, maybe even share them with friends, sell the vehicles, or what I would like to do is keep the vehicle because maybe you didn't have enough money to buy the vehicle in general. Now there's a few things I want to tell you guys about this glitch and a few things I want to warn you about. As you guys know, I love warning you whenever there's something going down and there's something you guys need to know. I'm here to report it to you guys I definitely want to give you guys an insight before you guys go doing anything you want in GTA just just to give a little bit of a backstory of what may happen and a few things as well I also want to talk about how you guys can be safe and a few things that you guys can do to stay potentially safe like I said I'm neutral here I don't really care if you guys exploit I don't care if you guys play legitimately I just want you guys to not get banned in GTA and I want to give you guys a few safe tips and rules to basically dodge any type of ban in general just getting into a cheaters pool or some type of bullshit like that you guys don't deserve it trust me it's bullshit I'm telling you guys this exploit is super super good I mean I'm not gonna tell you exactly how to do it but the way it works is you kind of need like a bike rack you also need a friend with that certain vehicle that you want to duplicate you got to duplicate it in your garage something like that along those lines all I know is that's how it kind of works then once you have the car for yourself, you can of course sell it or you could just do it over again with someone else that you really don't know in GTA Online and you maybe want to help them out a little bit. Or maybe you have a friend that wants a vehicle and maybe you could do that with him. But a lot of people have been getting bans from this and I want to let you guys know why people are getting banned, why people are getting in cheaters pool lobbies and why they are getting attacked by Rockstar because they're exploiting in the game. And I want to tell you guys how you can dodge this and kind of get away from all this. Now, I'm not going to say, okay, just don't do glitches anymore, guys. Don't do exploits because that obviously doesn't work. A lot of you guys like to do exploits in GTA because you don't have money. So I'm here to tell you the best way to stay hidden. So people are getting caught because they usually have a social club account linked with their account. See, I want to point out that social club literally collects all your information in GTA Online, whether you spend on money on ammunition, whether you spend money on cars, whether you spend money on clothes, whether you spend money in general, it's shows what you're buying and what you're selling and what you're doing on the social club and a lot of people don't really realize that you know they do these exploits in online especially if you do exploits on like next gen or maybe even last generation or or even pc i mean last generation i don't think really rockstar cares anymore because they're not really adding new dlc to that so if people are getting modded money the modded money is going for like what's already in gta but Rockstar is more focused on the next generation consoles and they're also focused on the PC. And a lot of people are getting caught and getting their accounts seized by Rockstar Games and permanent bans. I'm talking full on permanent bans, never going back to their console because the console is literally console banned. They're getting caught through Social Club. It's literally tallying up how many vehicles you're selling within a few minutes or how many vehicles you're getting in your garage within a few minutes. It's literally tallying up every bit of stats. So the best way to stay hidden, dude, if you are about to do this exploit, if you're about to exploit in online in general, I recommend you right now, right this second, unlink a social club account. If you do have a social club account attached to your online character, 
unlink that as of now before you go starting the exploit once you unlink the social club there's no way to keep stats of you there is millions of players in online that's how they keep stats up that's how they watch people is through social club and if you get enough like reports or something or in general if you see this there's like a lot of money just stacking up rockstar will literally get a a like a notification like a warning that you are going up real fast and it's it's really abnormal so the best way to stay hidden from this if you guys are going to go exploiting if you guys are going to go do anything in this nature i recommend you definitely stay low and unlink a social club account if there is a social club account linked to your account because trust me i'm going to guarantee this you do not want to end up with a permanent ban on your console i'm telling you right now you don't want a permanent ban on your console if it's like a ps4 or xbox one or pc man even last generation which i really haven't seen bans on there recently i know a lot of modders have been on those last generation like consoles and just giving away money like crazy so i don't think last generation you really have to worry but i'm pretty sure but most definitely next gen and pc you guys really have to watch out what you're doing and make sure you guys are under the radar like there is so many problems with online lately and i understand why people want money i understand why people want cash i understand why people want the easy way because it's hard to make money in online the 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 just the system in general is so fucked up with making money and how you have to spend money it's it's pretty fucked up and I can see where you guys are coming from. But I want to also point out, if you guys did go on full grind mode and you guys did really work for the money, you would have about $3 million in a week, you know? Or maybe even 4 or $5 million. Believe it or not, you would if you were going full grind mode. I just hate seeing people get banned, dude. I think it's just terrible. Like, you pay for this game, you pay for whatever you buy, you know? Like, if you use shark cards on this account, or if you've ever used shark cards in general on this account that you're using in the past, and then you automatically get a console ban because you decided to exploit this one time, didn't even realize that you were attached to a social club account, and then got targeted by Rockstar Games, and then got your account seized, and then you never got access to that account again that kind of sucks so i'm here to just warn you guys i'm here to let you know that this new exploit that has came out like this any car for free thing like if you guys go right ahead and do this if you go ahead and do this then just please play it safe that's all i ask that's all i ask from you guys that's just please play it safe because i want you guys to be in the best of the best i want you guys to have all the money i want you guys to do what you want in gta it's your game it's your experience you have fun but just be safe guys that's all i ask so what did we learn in this video there's a new exploit going around it's pretty big as of right now in the online community on all consoles this is including pc ps4 xbox one xbox 360 and ps3 you can literally get any card for free unlimited money everything like that along those lines there's a lot of people getting bans for this because it's so huge and a lot of people are using this right now to their advantage so the best way to stay safe i showed you guys just unlink your social club account and you guys should be good to go no more of these bands going out because i know how depressing that can be you literally go into online and then you see that your console has been banned all the accounts on your console has been banned even if you have like a little brother or a little sister or someone that plays on the console literally everyone will get like a ban or just in general you get a ban on your account or something like that i showed you in this video how to stay away from that how to dodge anything like that coming at you just make sure that your social club is unlinked but this video basically showed you guys how to stay hidden kind of stay under the radar and be safe in gt online while you exploit and do whatever you want so anyways i'm gonna start doing this new thing if you guys comment down a a certain comment that I leave at the end of the video that I tell you to comment I will reply to a few of you guys so this comment of this video is money glitch protectors yeah we are part of the money glitch protectors guys if you guys want to uh, put that in the comments I will reply to a few of you awesome mother lovers and if we could go guys for 30,000 likes dude that'd be awesome you guys have been amazing the support on this channel has been insane and I also always always point out that if you are signed into your YouTube account and you're new to my channel and you usually don't watch my content I recommend you guys do subscribe so you never miss another video like this here on my YouTube channel I I upload daily news informational videos anything that you guys need to know that i think is interesting i will share with you here on this youtube channel anyways guys thank you so much for an awesome awesome week we are growing so fast and uh the 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 speed and uh everything is just it's amazing guys it's a blessing and thank you guys so much for just an amazing week i'll have more videos for you guys in just a little love you love you love you you awesome mother lovers take care and i'll see you in the next one